It can start with sores on the legs or feet that won't heal, pains in the calves, especially when walking, or pale, even blue-colored feet. These are the signs of PAD, or peripheral artery disease. PAD happens when arteries, usually in the legs, become narrow or blocked, and certain factors make people more prone to the disease than others. People who smoke or are overweight are more likely to develop PAD. So are people living with type 2 diabetes, high cholesterol, or high blood pressure. The likelihood of developing PAD is also higher among people who are over the age of 50, African American, or have a family history of the disease. And when it comes to PAD, the stakes are high. If left untreated, the disease can cause a heart attack or stroke. It can also lead to amputations. That's why screening is important for people experiencing PAD symptoms. For people who are diagnosed with PAD, it's equally important to develop a treatment plan with a healthcare provider. A plan to improve quality of life and slow disease progression might include maintaining a heart-healthy diet, managing conditions such as high blood pressure, diabetes, high cholesterol, or obesity, exercising regularly, taking prescribed medications to reduce the risk of heart attack or stroke, or practicing good foot and skin care to prevent infections. Through widespread screening and effective disease management, healthcare providers, patients, and policymakers can work together to reduce PAD's impact in communities across the country. Learn more at advancedcardiohealth.org.